Notice items 3, Zone, Crown, and Social Distancing 3, guys. Uh, we're gonna reroll this one for sure. Ancient Archives 2 is just really, unfortunately, very risky right now. We're on... Are we on Thresh or Yurik? Okay, we're on Yurik. Roll the dice. This is just Social Distancing. Oh, great start. Great start. Great freaking start, guys. Okay. Social Distancing. Guard Breaker on him. We have an amazing early game, and what do we play here? We could play and we could play this girl with Ionia. I definitely will sell this guy. I mean, sure, we play her, right? I'll put her here. I'll put her there. I'll give this girl armor probably for now. Yeah, we just want the full early game. Remember, Jin is the best early game unit if Ionia is active. So if you get an early set, an early Jin and an early Irelia, you can already be happy. I even have a two-star Irelia, so that's great. And then we just go for the Guard Breaker because it's a good item for um, Vanquishers. Because we will just play Zaya most likely, right? The classic. The menace of the hatch. What do I want here? Do I want any of these? Not really. I mean, I'll buy her and call it day. Yeah, I'll buy her and call it day. This is good. The reason why we roll away the Zone Crown is just underpowered right now. You need to hit six Zone, which you pretty much rely on getting another Zone Emblem or a Zone Heart, which is pretty rare. And um, yeah, like getting both Zone Augments. And then you have six Zone, and then it's really strong because you get five uh, overcharged chem mods, but it still loses to Zaya. And like, we roll Rogues, we roll Cho'Gath, it still loses to all of these things, so... There's uh, you can maybe get a third, if you get lucky. You take a Zone Emblem at the start. Which is definitely not good enough, right? Okay, I'll buy this guy, I'll buy this girl, I'm not gonna play Ionia, I'm not gonna play, um, what's it called? Uh, Pilt over here, because we actually are in a good position where we can win streak. I get a second dude. I just make 10 rights. I'm not leveling here. Am I leveling here? I could play a, I could play a girl. A Cassio, which is pretty good. This guy's an easy win. This guy's an easy win. This guy is difficult to beat, but I have a better augment, so I should beat him. I just straight up have a better augment. And then this guy's an easy win. There, there ain't no way. Ain't no way we lose this. It would be crazy if we lose this. We, we are against the strongest guy. He has Ionia as well. There could be some tomfoolery going on where, I don't know, he just gets a lucky crit with Jin because I don't have crit on my Jin. I don't have a Vanquisher. Yeah, there is some tomfoolery going on, huh? I mean, there's no way I should be losing with this augment, so that's just a balance diff. Yeah, that's just balance diff. Uh, the fact that he wins with pumping up three, like he has the Vanquisher, right? That's much better. I don't have Vanquisher, but that's just tomfoolery by right there. There's not much we can do about that. There's not much we can do. What do we do here? Titans? Titans? Or do we just go for a tank item? The Bramble Vest is gone. Don't really want the Sunfire. Don't really want anything else. I'll just go for the bow, but I don't think I go Titans. I think I go... I aim for the Last Whisper, right? Super important. Most important item. When you play Zaya, Nila. Most important item there. I sell this. I don't think... I mean, I should still level, right? Like, the only reason I lost is because the other guy was... Exceptionally lucky. Um... I'm thinking about not playing her. I think she's so bad because she takes away from your, um, she takes away from your Ionia procs. Because there's only one unit can be Ionia at the same time, right? And she basically takes away from them because you don't want her to be Ionia. You want her for the resistances. He gets bonus health and he gets bonus attack damage, and she gets bonus AP. But she's so bad, right? She has no items. She she does nothing here. So I don't think I should be playing her. I might have even won if I didn't play her last last fight. Like, if I played a Samira instead, I might have won. But I don't think I found the Samira. Otherwise, I would have bought it. Pretty sure. 
Because I always buy Samira. You guys know me, man. I love my Samira. No way, I'm not gonna buy her. Two people are Mr. 100. I hope they fight each other. Otherwise, it is gonna be extremely rough for us. There is something much better here, which we will definitely play. And sell this trash. There we go. Alright, not too bad. Not too bad. Is looking okay. This guy, easy win. He's going for Samira 3. This guy doesn't have Rogue. He does have Rogue active. So I move to the other side so the Graves doesn't jump on my Jin. Okay, this is much better. Good thing we scouted that. Because I would have lost to this guy. He has so many 2 stars. He's actually insanely strong, yeah? Wait, he took out Rogue. He took out Rogue last second. He took out Rogue last second. He had the Echo in. Alright, so we couldn't get the full win streak, unfortunately, but we did fine. Do both of them keep their Mr. 100? Nope, they're fighting each other, so that's good. And you know who's winning? Oh. He won with triple with pumping up three. He has a Mr. 100 with pumping up three. This just shows how overpowered this is, right? But that's really unfortunate because pumping up three is such a good scaling augment. And he just wins with it. I mean, strategist, this guy has to be better than this girl. That's that's really crazy though. That's actually really crazy. Yeah, he won against Nautilus 2 with a Warmox. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he wins the game now because he has such a good scaling augment. I get an AP item, which is really awful here. But you know what? I might just pivot, man. Why don't I just pivot into Azir? Like, it's bad, but is it really that bad if I have an Azir with social distancing, Ginsu's, Guardbreaker, his two best, or two of his best items? Surely it's not that bad, right? Okay, my sound just went away. This sometimes happens. It's just the game. Oh, come back. Nice. Nope. It's here, but it's not here. Okay, it's back. Nice. Oh, I hate this. Man, this game has so many bugs, man. Like... If this is bad, then I don't know, bro. Like, like this guy is also playing... Uh, like, he's also playing the dudes, right? I don't know, man. He's also playing the dudes, the, the Zaya and stuff. I just don't think I'll hit. But now that I already have an Azir, I'll just play Azir. Like, sure, he's much worse. But, you know, a two-star Azir is surely better than a one-star Zaya, right? Or maybe not even a Zaya at all. Uh, healing Orbs is not bad. Ancient Archives is way too risky. Scope Weapons. Scope Weapons is freaking great, actually. Oh, Long Distance Pals is so good too, man. Scope is better. Okay, so the reason why we go scope here is I was basically thinking, I was basically thinking about two options. Either we go full strategist is here, full strategist is here, with Silco, and then we share the AP between them, right? We share the AP between them. We share the AP between Azir and hopefully we reach level 8, right? And then we just play Kai'Sa. And then we put Kai'Sa in the corner, Azir in the corner, and we share their AP. And that's great. And then we go last long distance pals because we can share their AP that they get from strategist. However, then I realized 
that I can also just go for this comp. I can go for this comp here. And then just play another... Um, and if I reach this comp, it's broken. If I actually reach this comp. Because I'm abusing all the long distance... Uh, all the scope weapons Andy's. I'm just abusing every scope weapon Andy. Scope weapon Andy Nila. Scope weapon Andy Mordekaiser. Scope weapons Azir is good. Because he gets a lot of attack speed from it. And then he could just chill in his corner and just uh, attack people from downtown. Yo, 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 don't take the Mordekaiser, you, you piece of garbage, man. Yo, 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 don't take my Jarvan. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, 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 thank you, thank you. Okay, okay, Jarvan with Bramble, that's good. So this is gonna be insane, because I get Vanquisher, I get three Noxus, I get two Slayer, I get four Jogger, I get three Strategist, and I get two, um, two Juicers. He surrendered? He surrendered with a Bramble. He built a Bramble and then he surrendered. Giga Chad. Holy frick, that piece of trash, man. Okay, I'm pivoting out of this. So why is this guy in? Ah, it should have been this, man. I'm not going double Bramble, am I? Okay, so hopefully we can get this comp, like Noxus... Holy frick, the, the bolt was about to hit him, man. I mean, I went on a 6 win streak, bro. Didn't I do well playing this as a year? I went on a triple win streak. Also, having a social distancing, bonus attack damage and stuff. Having social distancing, bonus attack damage and stuff. And then just having scope weapons for the attack speed is insane. I'm going forced. We cooked. I I, I took so long to think about that. Or long-ish, right? Long-ish. I didn't take that long. Alright, GG. We win. Is anyone playing Mordekaiser? He already has a Mordekaiser. Freak you. Okay, but honestly, it's not that many. Like, compared to Zaya, it's not that many. But also, I need to hit Nila. And if I don't hit Nila, it's not a big deal. I can just play something else as well. And by the way, I don't need to play this guy. I can just play this as well. But honestly, this is only three Juggernauts. Wait, where am I getting four Juggernauts from? I mean, yeah, my level 7 is just Swain then. Okay. Can I just go four Juggernauts at level 9 or something, I guess? If any, if even. I can just play... Oh, I just play... I just play freaking Silco at level 8. GG. Wait, my level 8 is just Silco. Oh, frick, that's not Silco. I get Sorcerer as well with Swain. That's not bad. Wait, I'm, I'm just Smorphing. I'm actually just Turbo Smorphing, man. Alright, this is a good one. This is a good one. I, mean, I can already roll. I'm definitely gonna roll on this level. I'm not playing this trash, am I? Oh, frick, I found a Silco. Okay, I'm not playing this. I'm not playing this. I mean, honestly, I should check... I should check um, if 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 Zon is worth. Oh frick! I should have checked if Zon is worth. Oh no! I don't really want this guy, but I mean I have to make him for now. Because what if I don't find anything else? I should have checked if Zon is worth. Why did I still? Why did I still not check Zon? Oh Zon is turbo worth. Okay, I mean it's just blue buff still cool then with Zon. Okay, so I have to play Zone. I don't even play Noxus. <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm Okay, I don't know what's wrong. I don't know what's wrong there. Something something went wrong there. That's for sure, man. <laughs> uh, I mean I didn't hit my units though. 
I'm not going to start start this guy because I'm gonna play Zon. I'm gonna play Warwick instead. So I'm not gonna go for this guy. I'm not playing this. I'm not playing her. Okay, I mean Zon is insane here because it's uh, viral and bioware. Okay, combat augment, just combat augment, combat augment, no, not not water forge. My items are good. Definitely not this, not lucky gloves, bro. Come on, not sorcerer crown, please, man. That's good, yeah. That's good enough. Good enough, man. No cap. And you're gonna give me Zaya when I don't need her, you idiot? Really? Really, bro? You're gonna give me Zaya when I don't need her? I'm hitting nothing. I have three Bramble Vests. <laughs> Based! Sterox. And Zon. I need uh, I need the Nasus too. I need to keep rolling on seven. Like it's fine to keep rolling on seven. I just need all my two star four costs, and then I can go level nine. I'm so strong. This guy just did Infernal Contract, and he still didn't hit anything. The void has breached this where are my four costs, man? Why am I not buying Warwick too? Why am I just skipping the Warwicks, man? Because don't I just give him Bramble as well? Like, who else gets Bramble? I mean, Jarvan at next level. Okay, so are we really playing this dirt, this this freaking piece of garbage, Talia, eh, uh, uh, this girl? Like, as soon as you see Silco, I need to play Silco, no? As soon as you see, as soon as you see blue buff and Viral and Bioware Silco, because this is just 18% bonus damage for free. You feel me? We have to play Silco then. Nah, this is some Bear Grylls wild cooking. Brother man, this is some Michelin star cooking, you piece of garbage. I have 94 health. I'm on a 10 win streak. What are you even talking about, man? Brother man, what are you even talking about, little guy? Think about it. Think about what you said. I'm smurfing on these guys. Okay, I need this item. Please, please. I'm begging you guys. I'm begging you. Don't, don't screw me, guys. Come on. Be nice, be nice. They were nice, they were nice. War mugs, war mugs. Okay, now my my Nasus is insane. Oh, frick. Oh, frick. Oh, frick. Ah, oh, frick. It's not another Bramble, man. Wait, Bramble, Bramble. Jewel Gauntlet, Bramble. Okay, frick it, it's another Bramble. I don't give a for you guys. Who do you think I am, man? It's another Bramble, man. It's another Bramble, man. Get out of here, you little idiots, man. It's another Bramble, guys. Yeah, baby! Based! Get tricked, little guys, man! Where are you at? I'm here! I have three Brambles, man! Oh, you're gonna play Zaya? You're gonna play Zaya? With bonus crit vanquisher? Oh no! Oh, what's that? Negates 50% bonus damage from incoming critical strikes. Oh no! Oh no, guys! Your entire team's dying to Bramble? Ah, unfortunate, guys, man. Keep playing your little Zaya. I'm gonna keep playing the Birdman. I'm gonna play the Birdman. Not really. He's trash. Don't play him, guys. Don't play him. I just go lucky. I just go lucky, guys. I just go lucky. Okay, I need this two-star uh, Nasus, man. Honestly, I roll here. <laughs> it's just a good decision. It's deserved because it was a good decision to roll. It was a really good decision to roll there, guys. 
it is what it is. You can you can say, hey, you're so lucky, Sherko, you're so lucky. You can say that. But it was just a good decision to roll, man. You can't really say anything about that. I can deadass play two Mordekaisers. I can just level, play double Mordekaiser, next level. Honestly, I need Slayer, bro. Like, I have nothing for him. I have a little bit of strategist for him. But I mean, isn't scope weapons already so good for him that it just doesn't even matter what you have? Like, isn't it just insane? But I mean, next AP item I go on, I, I go on Azir. He's like my main guy. I mean, this guy is just insane. I don't have a Giant Slayer. I need a Giant Slayer. I need a Giant Slayer really badly, guys, this game. I mean, we have a sword on the bench, so... He almost has a 3-star Soraka, so he's gonna be really strong to play game. I might not actually win the game, because... Because um, the 3-star Soraka guy, it's gonna be really strong late game. She's one of the best comps late game, man. I have four Bramble Vests. I have four Bramble Vests, guys. Good luck. Good luck, my little Pookie Bears. They're looking at me, they're so tilted, man. Man, stop giving me tank items, you stupid video game. Please, I'm begging you, man. I'm seriously begging you. Okay, I got Giant Slayer. I mean, I need Giant Slayer on him. I freaking need Giant Slayer, otherwise it's a dead last. He hit Soraka 3, so I don't need to hold it. He has a Radiant uh, Jokshow thingy, man. That's actually insane. Um... I mean, there's nothing I can do, so it's just this, lol. Lol. Oh, it's a one-star Zaya! Oh man! Oh, you're the guy that got early game lucky, Mr. Hans! Mr. Hart, Hart's Fia Hans! Oh man! Brother man! A little bit lucky here, huh? A little bit lucky here. Early game, pumping up three. Ah, oh, but you played a contested comp and you didn't hit like me all day. Now you're gonna go dead last like me all day. Yeah. Yeah. Double. Double Mordekaiser in the works. Because she's trash, man. If I'm not playing a Vanquisher, why even play her? And again, the only reason why we're not playing the thing that I wanted to play is because uh, Zon is the best one. This is the best zone. Vero and Bioware just gives my whole team bonus damage on Silco, and I got a blue buff on him, so... If I got a rapid fire cannon or something, I'll be playing... Uh, I wouldn't be playing him now. I'll be playing Neela. I'll be playing Darius. I would have three Noxus. It'll be great. It I would have actually preferred it. But as soon as I see the blue buff, I have two Silcos on bench. It's Vero and Bioware. You gotta go for that. GG. Uh, this comp, by the way, is really reliant on Jarvan, uh, on, on Nasus. Nasus is the most important unit on this comp, and you pretty much need exactly these items, otherwise you're going dead last. So this was actually pretty good. This was pretty good. Okay, so I will, uh, I need to bench the Nasus and just put it back in. Imagine you take one of these. Like, imagine you take the wrong thing. Wouldn't that be funny? Man, I'm down to play Noxus, bro. Like, I think it's a Noxus, man. Because Noxus, I already have three stacks because three people died. Like, it's not even that bad. Like, it's not even that bad, bro. It's not even that bad. And then I just level up. I play Aatrox. GG. It's a force. Let's go, guys. We level up. We play Aatrox. It's a force. I get Slayer. Oh, oh. You have a gang playing with the Vank. Vanquishy emblem? Oh man, you think he's gonna vanquish me? Brother man, you're about to get vanquished, little guy. Get out of here, man. You can't even kill my Nasus, you piece of trash. Get out of here, bro. You can summon the entire... Um, straw Hat fleet. I don't give a frick. You can summon 50 boats. Oh man, just take this Vanquisher emblem, guys. Get, get the free win, man. You're still gonna lose, guys. Don't worry about it. Aw. Oh, look at this, guys. Look at what I'm about to get. No, actually, I don't even want it. I think I want items. I don't even want Juggernaut Emblem. 
Because I just need Aatrox, no? But if I don't find Aatrox... The thing is, I need to play Aatrox anyway, because it gives him Slayer. So I literally need to play it. You feel me? So I think I just want the item, and... Isn't Titans okay? Titans is okay on him. Oh, it's okay. It's pretty bad. I'll keep it a buck fifty, guys. It's pretty freaking awful. But what am I gonna do, man? Like, what am I gonna do? Come on, tell me, please. Tell me what I'm gonna do. There's nothing else. I could have been stronger right now with the Juggernaut emblem, and I could have gone for like a cool only win streak finish. But I need to find the Aatrox anyway. Also, I don't think I'm going level nine this game. Even though, nah, the game's gonna end before I reach level nine. So I just roll it down on level eight after neutrals. I hope I still win. He, he has a one-star Zaya. If I lose, it's pre pretty imbalanced. Nice. Oh, Mr. Hot Sphere, brother man, brother man. <laughs> oh man, unfortunate guys. Why not Challenger Emblem on Morde? Uh, the thing is, Challenger Emblem with just two Challenger is extremely bad, in my opinion. Um, it just gives 20% more attack speed than this. While this gives a lot of AP and AD and stuff and the resistances, I don't know. Just don't like it. Just don't like it. Also, isn't isn't he isn't isn't Warwick our king? Because he's he's a he's a wolf. And I like these. I like the I like when they wear a wolf suit, guys. I love it when they wear a wolf suit, guys. Yeah. Yeah, the wolf suit, the rabbit suit as well, guys. The fox suit, I don't give a frick, guys. I love all of that. Yeah. Awoo, mother trucker. Awoo. Yeah, I love all of that, guys. Aw, oh, man. But you know what I like more than when he wears the wolf suit? When he takes it off. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, so this guy is the only one that can really contest me here, but he can really contest me. Why does he have two Tactician's Crowns, bro? I guess he just found one, and then the other guy just finds one. What, like, what is this game? How am I even winning against these guys? They're so lucky. Like, what? I mean, I should probably go level 9, right? But isn't it more fun to just go 3-star Mordekaiser or something? Alright, frick it. The river swells, guys. I'm about to swell as well. GG. What? I don't have heal reduction, but who cares? I have Giant Slayer on him his best item. The river swells, mother trucker. GG, guys. Uh, we have a giant slayer against this. We have double giant slayer, but we still lose against this, right? This guy's way too strong. Oh, wait. Nah, I still lose. I still lose for sure. He has, Zon uh, he has the rise with Shadow Isles as well. I mean, I should probably go level 9, man. Like, what the frick am I doing, man? Oh, Dragon Claw is great here. Redemption is not as good. Ah, uh, Dragon Claw is great against that guy. He has a lot of magic damage. Oh, double Dragon Claw? Sure. I'll take it, brother. I'm pretty sure I'll put it on him because he's gonna be four jugger. Okay, I'm pretty sure I go level nine, right? Like, I have to go level nine here. I could just go for a three star. Frick it. I, I feel like I need a three star to win the game. Maybe I just go for a three star. Frick it. Frick it, guys. Three, both three stars. GG. I'm gonna throw the game, but it's gonna be more fun than level 9. And honestly, I just need one Aatrox. Like, surely I can find one Aatrox when I roll, like, 7 million gold here. And then I'm just chilling. I just kick this worthless Dila and play Aatrox instead. GG. It's a force. Four Juggernaut. Four Juggers. I'm jugging it up. I lost against this guy as well. That's not good. Nah, bro, I'm 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 about to three-star my whole my whole planet, man. 
He's going level 9. I'm about to 3 star the entire planet. GG. I have 5 each. It's not even bad. I can probably 3 star at least one of them. They can't block everything. And he's trying to go level 9. I don't, I don't want uh, Kassante to kick my guy, but like this way he won't kick it. Oh, wait, he moved the Kassante here. Okay, so low key... I mean, that's a mistake, but I hope the Kassante isn't just strong enough. Oh wait, he healed so much. I mean, honestly, he kicked the... Oh wait, how did she get into the back line? Can someone explain how she reached the back line? She is here, and she just walks up. That's bugged. That has to be bugged, straight up. That's just a bug. Really? He doesn't take away my QSS. <laughs> Rookie mistake. I have the two best items on Mordekaiser now. QSS and the thingy. Oh, Guardbreaker is great. Go for it on this guy. Aww. It's just so easy. Okay, I know I don't need to commit yet, but it's kind of fun, right? Uh, kind of stupid, though. Also, I have 42 health left. Like, I probably lose next turn. But I have QSS now on Mordekaiser. Maybe I'm strong enough. Sante is in the wrong spot for him, for sure. His Nico died this time. But he's so strong in general. He's not holding a single 4 cost. I beat him here. Okay, honestly, I just... I just sack. I just sack. I, might, I mean, he might lose, but if he loses, he loses. Like, I'm pretty sure he's not gonna lose, because he goes... Three, he, goes uh, he goes level 9 now. Yeah, he's level 9 now. He's not gonna lose now. Ain't no way he loses, right? Ain't no way, little bro. He hit Heimer too. I I just I just lose this and then I roll it down. And he has nothing, no gold to hold my units. So I'm just guaranteed three star, four cost. GG. I sell these two as well. And he's gonna like. Why does he keep ulting my? You have to ult the Nasus, man. You can actually kick the Nasus. I'm not repositioning. He's gonna ult away. Yeah, you, you can't do that. But I mean, the Nico isn't gonna... Wait, he might actually lose. Like, he, he misplayed so hard, man. Ah, he still wins here. Okay. Oh, it's just RNG if the if the Nico revives with, with Rise, huh? Okay, interesting. Okay, so he's gonna roll now to, ho to hold my four costs, but... I mean, he can't. Also, I'm gonna roll a little bit, because I'm, I'm a boomer, guys. You know me. I'm gonna roll to 20. I'm gonna roll to 20, man. I'm a boomer, guys. You know me. Like, guys, I'm, I'm sorry, man. Like, you, you, you know me, I'm a boomer. Like, now I actually have a viable amount of gold that I can roll. Without messing up. I've never gotten this scammed. I actually waited. I I maximized my money. I actually maximized my money. I never got this hard scam. This was so unlucky. He doesn't have a single Azir. That was so disgustingly unlucky. I've never gotten this scam. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Because it's level, it's stage seven. Isn't this game really bad? Like. You can play this 100 times, this roll down, and I, I swear, 
at least like 70 out of those 100 times, you will have two of them. You will have two. You will have both Silco and Azir. Zero contested. I have never seen something like this. Oh well guys, we played it extremely well. We didn't get lucky out of our booty like these like this guy. Like how does he even have a three star Melio by the way? Like this should not be happening, right? Like you reroll for these two, you don't even have money for a three star Melio. You're not rolling at five. So I don't even know how these things happen, but the enemies make them happen, right? But that's okay. For us, we have to be happy with a two star Azir. Amazing guys, we'll take it though. Still a fun game, still a very cool comp here with the scope weapons. And um, yeah, subscribe and notification bell if you enjoy these TFT videos. Also make sure to leave an algorithmic comment and an algorithmic like down below to support this video in the algorithm so I can get some more views. I'll see you next time.